Hi everyone, welcome back. So I'm sure you all know that how much I love makeup and since I'm shooting all day every day, I tend to carry a lot of makeup with me at all times. So I thought I should show you what's in my makeup bag. Uh, so this makeup bag is by Color Bar. So I just keep picking up things one by one in no particular order and let's see what's there inside. So the first thing that I see is the Bird Bees hand cream. Now I have this this weird habit that I can't stand dry hands so I always make sure that I keep applying hand cream every now and then. So currently I'm uh, using the Bird Bees Honey and Grape Seed hand cream. Then I have the Lavender and Bergamot dry shampoo by Bio Organic. Now this is for those days when my hair is a little greasy or the second or third wash day. So this is for that instant bounce and that uh, uh, dryness that I want on my scalp. Uh, this is the um, new latest launch by Faces. It's the Faces Ultimate Pro Face Palette which has a bronzer, blush and highlighter. It's extremely pigmented and the texture of these powders is really soft and the very the very smooth and well retained texture. So I'm in the shade Glow which is more towards the medium to darker skin tone. So um, this is my current go-to. For the primer, I'm using the Color Bar Perfect Match Primer primer because I always have to make sure that my makeup is long lasting and it lasts all day long. So uh, this is uh, something that I apply before applying a foundation and it gives a really even finish to my face and uh, helps me achieve the perfect base that I'm looking for. For the foundation, this is my absolute Go to foundation. It's a lightweight uh, foundation by Maybelline. It's the Fit Me one. I'm in the shade 310 Sun Beige, and this is a lightweight foundation which is perfect for uh, all day and you know, like a daily routine foundation. And it's suitable for all skin types. But uh, yeah, so this is from medium to heavy coverage, so you can build it as per your preference. For the mascara, I have the uh, Tarte Lights Camera Flashes Mascara. Now this one has a really uh, like an edgy and very uh, pokey wand which helps me to achieve that voluminous look. Then for the eyes, I do not carry eyeshadow palettes since you know that how uh, heavy and you know bulky it gets. So I make sure to carry these eyeshadow sticks. I believe that these eyeshadow sticks are really handy and they come very useful. So I have two of them by Color Bar. This one is in the shade Blush which is like a pink nude shade. And the other one is Mulberry which is a light purple one. And I also have a black uh, Jumbo Eye Pencil by NYX for those days when I want an instant smoky eye on my eyes. For the brushes, not nothing too much, but I have three makeup brushes. This one is by Real Techniques. It's a powder brush. This is the 3D HD Kabuki brush by Sigma, my all-time favorite and absolutely uh, go-to foundation brush. And this one is to blend the eye makeup. It's a, a big fluffy brush for the eyes. Then this is my beauty blender by uh, YBP, it's by far the best beauty blender that I've ever used. It uh, gives a really a nice airbrushed finish to the entire makeup and very soft in texture. It's very easy to apply. For the concealer, I have my two favorite concealers here. MAC Pro Longwear in the shade NW35 and L'Oreal True Matte in the shade N425. Both of them are creamy in texture and they're high coverage. Perfect for people who have heavy dark circles and they are really nice. Then I also carry this Nasho Vitamin E Lip Balm which has SPF 30 so it helps me to get rid of all the chapped lips and it keeps my lips smooth, supple and moisturized at all times. I also carry this Color Essence uh, Gel Pot Liner. This is the, the bestest of best black and it's the most easiest way of applying a eyeliner since it has a a brush along with it so you can actually create a nice winged uh, liner then for the compact this is the one that I have in my makeup bag it's the L'Oreal true match compact powder and I'm in the shade uh, golden beige yeah so I believe that this one is a shade lighter to my actual skin tone but 
yeah but i i do uh, buff that really well in my skin so i manage with it so the texture is really soft very uh, nice powdery it does not dry my skin out and does not create any dry patches on the skin for the eyebrow i carry the bobby brown long wear brow gel i'm in the shade mahogany which is more towards like a a like a gray shade with some dark brown undertones to it so this is my current favorite then i have my eye lens case now i also have this karma rose water uh, spray for times when i feel really dry on my skin and i want an instant boost of energy so i also use this as my makeup setting spray now i'm sure you all know how big a um, lipstick junkie i am and i always carry like 5 to 6 to 7 lipsticks with me at all times currently i have 6 of them so i'll show you each one of them and i'll give you a swatch as well so this one is the faces ultim pro in the shade spiced latte now this one is more like a, a really nice nude lipstick with some pink undertones to it i think it's suitable for all indian skin tones and it's my current nude color this one is by revlon this one is the truest um what do you say the fuchsia color it's the revlon uh, hd matte lip color in the shade obsession it's a liquid lipstick which turns matte in no time Then I have this baby pink shade, more like a Barbie pink. This one is from the Lakme 95 Crease Line range in the shade Rose Line, and uh, like a light pink which has a lot of glossy effect on it. Then I have a purple shade by L'Oreal in the shade uh, Glamour Fuchsia. Now this one has more like blue undertones to it, but it's on the purplish side. And then I have my Clinique's Matte Crimson. This is again I'm sure you all know how much I love this red color by Clinique. And another shade that I have, the last one is by Maybelline Color Show range. This one is in the shade Cherry Crush. It's a nice um like a pinkish reddish, a carrot color maybe. So yeah, with a lot of uh shine in it. So yeah, these are my uh lipsticks that i have in my makeup bag at present and these are actually my favorite ones so yeah and my makeup bag is empty now so i hope you like watching this video and let me know in the comment section if you have any more such requests i will love to do that and i will see you in the next video make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel bye